Here we are in High Point uh, in West Seattle. This is a bioswale here, and it's um, been raining all night. This extends for quite a ways along the edge of a park here. This is 120 acres, part of the Longfeld Creek watershed. Normally, this bioswale is actually dry, but here you can see water is actually not just sitting here, but running through this bioswale, which is actually just a more modern term for ditch. And this section of the bioswell um, holds waters. There's um, water drinking plants here. They help soak up and purify the water as it um, sinks down into the soil, into the um, water table below. Eventually it does flow down to the high point um, pond, which um, is a, uh, has a quarter acre or a quarter mile. Let's see, I think it's a three acre pond has a quarter mile walking trail around it. I'll just let you hear the water flushing through here. It's quite loud. But there's several of these all over the neighborhood, all designed to slow down water flow and reduce flooding at Longfellow Creek. And you can see the seagulls have found something to eat out here today too, so it's almost like you're at the beach. So. So I'm Wendy Hughes-Jellen with uh, GreenspacesRealEstate.com and Westside Green Living with Wendy on Facebook. And that is how a bioswell actually is supposed to function during heavy rain. Thanks for watching. Have a nice day.